Hey guys, it's Whack Tech, and I'm going to be installing subtitles. If you didn't add the Fusion repository yet, check out my other video. In my previous video, I added the Fusion repository and installed third-party add-ons inside of Kodi. Start by opening Kodi and going to Add-ons. Once inside of Add-ons, there's a little box at the top. Click it. Now we want to choose Install from repository. If you've installed Torque Playlist from my previous video, Kodi add-on repository should be here. Move down until you see subtitles. You don't need to install every subtitle add-on, since that would take up a lot of space on the Amazon Fire Stick. Now you want to look for opensubtitles.org. Click install and wait a second for it to download. After it's complete, you want to click it again. Move all the way to the left and click Configure. Unfortunately, we need to create an account to use this add-on. Alright, I'm going to load up the web page on my PC. I'll see you over there. Open up your web browser and go to OpenSubtitles.org. OpenSubtitles supports both movies and TV show subtitles. On their web page at the top, you'll see Register. Click it. Now fill out the web form and go back to the Amazon Fire Stick. Once you're done typing your account information, click on OK on the right hand side. Now you want to go back to the Kodi main menu. At the top you want to click the little gear icon. Inside of system settings, look for player settings. Move down to language and look for download services. Select Default Movie Service and a window will pop up. Now choose OpenSubtitles.org and click the big button on the remote. Move up and click the Default TV Show Service. Choose OpenSubtitles.org and click the big button on the remote again. Now you're ready to download subtitles for movies and TV shows. Open Exodus and start a movie. After the movie starts, click the button with the three lines on the remote. And then a menu will pop up on the bottom. Choose Subtitles and a menu will pop up. Click Download. It'll start searching for subtitles and populate the list. Just make sure the selection is in English and it has at least 5 stars. After it's done downloading, the window will disappear and your movie should have subtitles. In my next video, I'll be discussing more about add-ons for Kodi. If you need any help, please leave me a comment.